Ladies, Gentlemen, Mesdames, Messieurs, Meine Damen und Herren, Senores y Senoras, it is uh, game number two of the semi-final, number two of the four players close combat cup here, and it is Nurture against Pomi. Nurture, guess what, he's behind one game, guess what, up with Pomi, he's up one game, and before the game started, as we were in the lobby, there were two things happening, Nurture was complaining about imbalance, and then Pomi said, oh, okay, so they will fix it sooner or later, and as soon as they fix it, you will win everything, every tournament, and every game. And Nurture said, yes, that's absolutely true, and that's why I am not too sad about it. So, um, showing us, Nurture showing us once again that he's a really nice guy, <laughs> and really a funny guy. And, um, game, uh, the second thing I was talking about is, uh-huh, they, if it's... If Nurture wants to win this next game, it cannot be close positions, but guess what it is? We have Nurture here spawning at the 3 o'clock as the yellow Zerg player, and we have Pomi here at the 6 o'clock spawning close positions at the red Protoss player. So it is close positions already, and uh, Nurture is aware of this because he just spotted the probe uh, in his base right away, and this was just... And a thing not too pleasant for him. There we see the gateway for Pomi just finished. And a oh, cybernetics call coming up right away. Still Nurture is in his base. And I'm wondering if Nurture is going for an extractor steal. And I just waited for Nurture commentating the close positions, by the way. And there we go. Thank you. We really can uh, rely on Nurture. We can trust him. That he's always doing a, a little bit more of a favor to entertain us. He's... Basically, the action Jesus without the cheese in terms of entertainment. So, so Pomi now asking him if his uh, comment was referring to the close positions, and of course it was. So, there we go. What is Nurture doing right now? He's not going for a fast roach run, instead, he's just started with a. Uh, uh, <laughs> Just started with a metabolic boost upgrade, and this queen just let the probe here uh, run away. There it is, actually, because he decided to prioritize the lava inject over the attack. Maybe waiting two seconds with the lava inject uh, to kill the probe would be a nice thing to go for. And exactly, Nurture is absolutely right about it. The chance that you spawn close positions is 33%, of course. Um, subjective, it is 110% for Nurture, but uh, what am I talking about? What is the standard follow-up if a player is spawning here on close positions? It is the four gate, gate number one, gate number two, gate number... Oh, where is it? Here it is, in the corner behind the mineral line, gate number three, and at the front, it was the first gate already, gate number four it is. So the question now will be, what will Pomi do? He's got three options. Option one is to go for an attack straight away, place a pylon here, place a pylon there, place a pylon and everywhere, or go for the four gate into expand, like in the last game, or even go for the four gate into a fake expand into four gate attack. So what will he go for and how many roaches will have nurture out in time? For the moment he's got six roaches finished, so six roaches it is. On the other hand, Pomi, one, two, three, four, five sentries. Of course sentries not too effective. Now moving down the ramp with the sentries. And if he's moving out with the sentries and the roaches moving out at the same time, this could be a very good thing for Nurtio. Now the sentries are attacking the roaches and of course the sentries have to run away. And now the sentries have the same movements then the roaches here are some zealots here are some stalkers as well with the other round of newly warped in units it is not looking too good and now nurture being a little bit too over eager there um losing two roaches in the process but nice job here by pomi um and uh, by nurture to reinforce with the lots and lots of zerglings instead of roaches keeping Pomi on one base, containing him, and now he's droning up a little bit, but he needs to be careful that he does not drone up too much. So five more drones is what he's producing right now. So then he will be at 30 drones compared to 28 um, probes, but still remember, 30 drones on two bases, 
much more efficient than 28 probes on one base because 28 probes is actually more than you need. You need 16 probes for the mineral line and you need 3 probes in each assimilator which makes it 22. 16 plus 6 is 22. Special Andre going to the university showing it us to, uh, to showing it us to uh, once again showing it to us once again here we go so nice force fields defending uh, repelling a couple of those um, what are they called zerglings I expected nurture to try to snipe out a couple of more sentries but this was not the case instead he's just warping in more uh, mopping and morphing and more roaches a couple of zirklings as well and this is really what I like not uh, relying too much on the pure zirkling not relying too much on the pure roach maybe a second spine crawler would be a good choice because now it is time tasteless Pomi is trying to go for an attack here Phosphate is very well placed but all the roaches are there and all the roaches can attack right now which unit are they attacking they need to take out the sentries one sentry after another because it's actually not many zealots here in the mix and he's only got a one zirkling uh, one century life now all the centuries are dead and <laughs> meanwhile this battle was still go on Nurture showing us why he is Nurture and um, this was what I was talking about he was able he is able to chat uh, leave some entertaining comments here meanwhile uh, really a big battle is still happening and for example if he's um, doing a big mistake from time to time being a mismicro not paying attention there it is just a comment like FML coming up so he's just morphing in more unit but this game is not yet over the stalk is doing a good job at kiting the roaches now the roaches are kiting the zealots but with more zirklings being in here this should be it this forget attack was denied so not you, even though it was close positions taking this game, doing a nice job with his early roach attack, reinforcing with the Zerklings, keeping Pomi on one base, forcing Pomi to go for an 4-gate all-in attack, and after defending it, trolling a little bit, taking game number two. So, this series is now tied up a 1-1, and whoever wins the next game will advance to the finals and either face Die Star or Underdark. So, just stop the VOD recording and actually... <laughs>